Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so, so much for clicking yet another video and welcome if you're new. My name is Taddy G and on this channel, I like to share what it's truly like to run a clothing brand as well as trying to drop tips, tricks, jams and all of that good stuff. And in today's video, we are gonna be covering nine email campaigns you should be sending to your customers in order to boost sales for your business. Email marketing, as old school as it kind of sounds, works for several reasons. It allows you to directly reach your audience, which actually has a higher chance of being seen than that of like a social media post, because with social media, you are battling <laughs> with the algorithm. And although, you know, with social media posts, you can reach like new audiences, with the people that you're targeting in your email marketing campaigns, they already have an interest in your brand, which means that they are more likely to actually engage with your email. It is cost effective. You can automate certain types of emails and you can personalize emails to suit different audiences. You can get really creative in the way your email actually is presented. And it gives you an opportunity to actually showcase your brand's personality and engage with your audience. You can use like eye-catching designs, compelling, copy and the great thing about like AI I use snapchat AI quite a lot you can actually use AI to essentially write your email campaign for you if you're somebody that's a little bit like lazy or has writer's block or has absolutely no idea what to write and within those emails you can actually link like some of your social media so that people can hopefully take a deeper dive into your business and within an email campaign you can add like links to pictures to words so that people are always led back to your website to potentially make a purchase. So what types of emails should you be sending? So one type of email that you absolutely need to have is a welcome series. So a welcome series is basically a series of emails that you send to a potential customer once they have signed up to your email list. The first email you could send is like a thank you, sort of like thanking them for joining your email subscription. And you could even offer them like a discount on all the items in your store if you want to. But that's the sort of thing that I would include in a very first email in my welcome series then maybe like my second email which I would send out like possibly like a week later would cover a little bit more about the brand so you could sort of almost copy and paste <laughs> your about me page and essentially a customer would receive that email and start to you know read a little bit more about the brand you could even like include an email that tells the customer a little bit more about you so a welcome series is definitely definitely a powerful set of emails to have automated for your website and a great thing about a welcome series is that it's definitely something that you can automate so you can set it up that okay when a person subscribes to your email list you're going to send this email after like an hour this email after a week this email after two weeks and just like leave it alone another type of email that you're going to want to be sending are promotional campaigns so this is when you have a sale so you could have like a flash sale or a special offer and a great thing about these emails is that it does create a sense of urgency for your subscribers like they need to shop now 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 otherwise they are going to miss out on this potential money saver if they don't act now so promotional emails are definitely an email that you need to be sending especially if you're having like a sale be it like a black friday sale or a mother's day sale whatever it may be the next type of email you absolutely need to be sending and these are probably like my favorite types of emails to send and that is when you have launched a new product or you've added a new product to your website or maybe you've added like a new size to a product on your website you definitely are going to want to be keeping your customers updated with anything new that's happening in the product world of your business so definitely ensure that you are sending that email because it keeps customers updated and excited everybody likes something fresh and new so make sure you're taking this opportunity to promote to your customers something fresh and new. Number four, and this is probably like one of the most important types 
of emails to be sending to your customers and that's an abandoned cart email so whenever somebody like shops on your website and they've kind of sort of like not fully checked out you are going to want to send them an email to say hey there's still something in your basket would you like to complete your purchase to then incentivize them for them to actually complete their purchase you could say something like i'm offering you free shipping if this is not something you already offer or i'm going to give you like a discount to just help them <laughs> actually check out that card the fifth type of email that you're gonna want to be sending out to your audience are what we call like re-engagement campaigns so you might have a group of subscribers that have been quite inactive on your website so um they haven't purchased something they've just you know subscribed and have just kept like quiet you could just send them an email to sort of like re-engage them and offer them like exclusive content or perhaps like a special discount or incentives to actually just become a little bit more active um, on your website again with some of these inactive subscribers they might actually take this opportunity to then unsubscribe <laughs> from your email list but this is not a bad thing because it's always good to have an email list that is actually like a quality email list and not just be emailing people for the sake of emailing them when they literally have no interest in your brand and especially because these emails cost so anything over 10,000 emails on Shopify it's going to cost you an additional dollar so you want to be sending emails to people that actually care the seventh type of email campaign you can be sending are newsletters now on my website teddyg.co.uk this is a type of email that i like to send it sort of like gives people like a little update or maybe if i've uploaded a youtube video i might send them an email to say new video out or i might send them an email to say i've written this new blog post check it out or i might send them an email that sort of just gives them a little update on what's happening in the world of tally g so this is sort of like the type of emails that you're going to send out that would be considered like a newsletter type email it's just like a little update like a little check-in like hey we're here and this is what's happening and i apologize for my voice guys it's literally because i am not well <laughs> the eighth type of email campaign you can send out are seasonal promotions now these ones i feel like kind of go without saying so if christmas is coming up send them an email relating to christmas new year's send them an email relating to new year's valentine's day mother's day father's day fourth of july for those in the us easter whatever it may be send them a promotional email links to whatever holiday is happening maybe you can have like a christmas sale or a valentine's day sale or maybe you have a product that is like eastery <laughs> you could promote that product within that season now the final type of email campaign that I feel like you should be sending out to your customers. This one is kind of like sweet. It's just like a customer appreciation email. Like if you see like you have customers that are like always ordering from you, you could just send them like a lovely little note to say sort of like thank you for being supportive. And perhaps you can like give them early access to a new collection that you're releasing or give them like a special reward or like say, okay, you are a valued customer i want to send you something for free so my valued customers they typically get a free pair of socks so you could like sort of like say thank you so much for being such a valued customer we're gonna send you out some socks please let us know if your shipping address is still the same or something we will be sending them out in like a couple of days time or something just something to show your appreciation to that particular customer or group of customers so yeah those are nine types of email campaigns you could be sending to your customers in order to boost sales and get people back on your website another one you could send out a bonus one educational campaigns so say if you are like me my taddy g website is quite educational so i did mention that i do send out like blogs and my blogs are kind of like educationally so um the last blog i think i sent out was all to do with what was it to do with pop-ups it was to do with like hosting your first pop-up shop what websites you can use what things you need to remember that is like an educational email campaign that you could send out so instead of like me having that as just like a blog post i could kind of just have all of that information in the email because typically i actually just write it as blog posts but maybe i might start writing a blog post and also just copying and pasting that blog post in an email and seeing like how that sort of like performs 
I don't know we'll see but yeah I really really hope that this video has been helpful and you have you know gotten like a few ideas of what sorts of emails you could be sending to your customers in order to boost sales for your business get people on your website and re-engage those quiet subscribers so yeah I will definitely definitely catch you guys in my very next video thank you for watching bye